Hey guys, thanks for joining me today. My name is Brittany and I'm going to show you my favorite way to do hundreds on the Cadillac or in this case, the tower. So we often learn that we have to have our head towards the tower when we're doing, you know, like the mid back series and coordination and all that kind of stuff, but it really strains the neck flexors. So turn it around, totally different experience. So I've got my arm springs hooked into the front of the tower here. And then when I ask people to do this, first you lie down and I have them just test the springs here while their head is down. So we know we have some resistance because when we flex up, we're gonna need the same amount of resistance. Um, a lot of times people start too close and then there's slack. Okay, we also actually wanna make contact every time, okay? It's not figurative like some of the other cues, I actually want you to make contact. So when you're practicing with your head down, notice that when you make contact, your lats turn on more and so do your triceps. We want that, okay? And then release. So I'm gonna start with my heel, my feet down. And the reason is because I find that I can keep a, a stronger connection in my lower back and in my lower back belly for this particular version of 100. So for today, I'm gonna to have the feet down. Uh, I will show you the other versions, but this is my preference, especially in a group. All right, so seeing, counting, breath, all that goodness with hundreds as usual. So we inhale through the nose and prepare, connect our pelvic floor, and then we're gonna flex forward just enough to see right through the thighs. Arms are long, we're connecting. Inhale, two, three, four, five, breathe out. Inhale, and exhale, 20. So I don't have to lift up that high, I feel it right away because we do have some load here. Exhale, that said, Okay, speaking of load with flexion, because this is not against the flexion, you can do this with somebody who has uh, osteoporosis, osteopenia. You wouldn't be able to do it facing the opposite direction. So let's just pause here. I think it's like 70. I'm a terrible counter. We can also, of course, lift to tabletop. A lot of people lose that connection in their lower tummy with the added resistance. You can of course do it with long legs, harder still. Breathe in, two, three, four, five, breathe out. We can also hinge and lower. Hinge and lower. Okay, bend the knees in, foot, foot, head down. Okay, and then all the way up. So that is my favorite way to do the hundreds on the Cadillac or the tower, rather than facing this way, because when you come up with the springs this way for hundreds, usually immediately following the abs, the abs, of course, are your screaming muscle, but a close second are the neck flexors. So I certainly prefer to have my feet toward the tower for the hundreds. So hopefully that is a nice substitute for the way maybe you were doing it. So let me know what you think in the comments below. And I look forward to doing this again with you next time.